Many of the top luxury fashion brands prefer retail sales directly to consumers, but a growing number of them are also distributing and trading through Farfetch. This is the only luxury fashion store that offers high-end fashion on a large scale. Luxury brands like Chanel and Saint Laurent are available here as well as high-end stores like Harrods and Harvey Nichols. Farfetch is a startup with Portuguese DNA that has become a unicorn. Established in 2007, it currently has a user base of 2 million in 190 countries who are engaged with 500 brands and 700 boutiques. With over USD 300 billion in the luxury fashion market today, it has maintained rapid growth before it was listed in 2018. Even with the pandemic's immense impact, Farfetch has recently received $1.1 billion in investment from Chinese competitors Alibaba and Richemont. Aiming to expand in China, Farfetch provides luxury brands to the market. The rapid growth of $1 billion fashion startup is catching everyone's attention. And if you are also interested to know the secret recipe of their success, then let's see what makes Farfetch so successful. As compared to Netapote, Neil's business model is unique, so it can keep up with trends more quickly. Instead of connecting brands and consumers directly, it acts as a marketplace that earns about 30% of sales as commission and has an efficient distribution system that matches supplies and demands. As a supplier, they provide brick-and-mortar retailers with strong online visibility for their customers. Additionally, they make brands more accessible to the millennials, who shop online more than ever before. As for the demand side, shoppers can choose from a wide range of high-quality products from top brands along with exceptional customer service and convenience. A growing user base leads to more brands joining and vice versa. According to Neve's direct-to-concessions model, a brand decides what product to sell on Farfetch and determines its price so that there are no price cuts that could damage its reputation. As a way to monetize the platform, it charges brands a combined 25% on sales of goods and an additional 8% for order fulfillment. The company generates 70% of its revenue from commissions. In addition to attracting a strong customer segment of young men and women, Farfetch consistently sees orders of 550 to 650 USD. On their website, they feature a wide range of brands and boutiques. This company operates with no inventory requirements. Using an efficient back-office system, they locate products around the world and arrange for shipping and delivery with the company. The company is known for fast delivery in certain major markets, including New York and London. The company offers same-day delivery in 19 cities. Additionally, customers can return products for free. In the luxury fashion industry, Farfetch has become a renowned name for both brands and consumers. In addition to luxury, they are known for being selective, reliable, customer-oriented, fast, etc. And all these things are making them successful. But what about sustainability? When brands and boutiques deal with Farfetch, they give up some control and information that could be helpful to them in the future. They will have to find organic ways to attract users if they want to keep adding brands to propel user growth. So this is the overview of the success story of Farfetch. Hope you like this video. Don't forget to share your thoughts with us. Thanks for watching. Like, comment and share it with your friends if you found this video useful. Subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for further updates.